Hey everyone and welcome to another video. So today what we're doing is taking a look at how to activate spatial audio using either the AirPods Max or the AirPods Pro with tvOS 15. So I have already done a video on how to install tvOS 15, the beta. If you want information on that, I will link that in a card in the top right. But for this video, we're going to crack straight on. So first thing you want to do is on your remote, hold the TV button. to pop up the control center. You then want to come down to the AirPlay icon. And from here, you want to choose your AirPods Max or AirPods Pro. So I'll just pop my AirPods Max on and then come down and select AirPods Max. Okay. So in this menu here now, you, um, you've got a few other options as well. So firstly, you have a sort of volume control. So just below that, you do have the share audio option. So if you do want to pair up a second pair of headphones, I've not actually tested this on this particular beta version. In, in the past, I have actually got it working with uh, two sets of AirPods Pro. At that time, I didn't actually have my AirPods Max, but if you wanted to add a second pair, what you do is you click share audio. So you can't just go down and click a second uh, item so you could for example the uh, LG soundbar or anything like that because what that will do is it'll actually switch to that source so what you have to do is um, click share audio and then all you do is you literally just bring that particular set of headphones near the Apple TV and it will then pair with it and it will set it up um, you'll then get two icons um, I may do a separate video on um, pairing up and doing shared audio so if you if you're interested in that just leave me a comment down below so once it's set up what you want to do is come back to this control center and you should now see an option for the actual AirPods Max so if we click onto that it now gives us a few options so straight away you can see it gives you access to the, your noise control your your noise cancellation essentially and then you also have an option here for spatial audio now by default I believe this is off um, but when something is playing you can actually come in and switch it on and then as you can see it will actually leave it enabled okay so if we come into the Apple TV and we just go to anything so I'll, I'll just play the uh, latest trailer for in invasion and if I just click on the trailer, um, what I will do is I'll do a separate insert of where I actually demonstrate how this is actually working. Um, but f for you guys, obviously at the moment, you're not going to be able to hear anything. But for me, listening into this, if I activate Control Center now, come down to the same menu, you'll see spatial audio is now on so it's playing via Dolby Atmos but the spatial audio is it's, it's almost like a 3d location of which way you're facing now I'm just going to pause that whilst so when you do pause it obviously it goes it goes grayed out again essentially what this is doing is um, it's mimicking what my soundbar in front of so the soundbar that I have along here um, it's basically mimicking that and essentially what it's doing is it's keeping the center channel in front of me um, based on my right and left channel so it's basically using the sensors built into the actual AirPods Max themselves it recognizes where where your head was when you first started playing that particular content and then whenever you turn left or right it will then um, keep the actual center channel where, where it initially was so it essentially sounds like you have surround sound despite the fact that you've only actually got two 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 speakers one on each ear um, so yeah it, it does actually work really well it works better um, when you're literally just watching content so this whole thing about moving your head around and actually demonstrating it in that way um, that's pretty much um, it's, it's just the gimmick that actually dictates and demonstrates how how effective it is but the real magic of spatial audio is the fact that it can take a Dolby Atmos type of um, stream and sound and mimic it in, into your, your headphones essentially. So it does work really, really well. And this is just a quick guide in terms of how you actually go about setting that up. 